everybody and welcome to the Sparkle and Sprinkle August release. Now remember the most important thing to do is take advantage of the savings that is happening right now for a limited time on all these new stamp sets. So to get started I am going to go ahead and show you the rubber stamp set and then the digital. So here is this beautiful rubber stamp set Feathered Friends stamp set number 909 and you get the two really cool the wreath and the three birds and then the two sayings We are birds of a feather and so grateful Our designers went to town with this stamp set. Let me tell you. So there is the digital version So you also get this bonus little flower little flower grouping together, which is really nice and then to get started, I'm going to bring all these over to my lap. Okay, here is a fantastic card by one of our designers using the wreath and the So Grateful saying, I love the blues. Look at all the different fun things that she did with her quarter inch terrific tape with the glitter in the terrific tape making glitter ribbon using the really fun specialty paper. And then we also have the embossing powder on our terrific tape, which is something you do not want to forget about existing out there. Pretty awesome. Here is another totally different look using that same amazing stamp set. She is using the digitals here, which is awesome. Looks so cool. I love the pop of the dark blue with the feathers, the stenciling in the background and our beautiful mirrored cardstock and that awesome blue glitter. And that glitter is a blue lightning. Isn't that amazing? Fantastic job. Here is a sweet and delicate card using the wreath. And I just love this technique. So she went ahead and stamped with the white embossing powder on the vellum and then used her Copic markers to just give it a nice little coloring. It just gives it such a soft look. Also using the beautiful, I'm gonna say Peach Bellini, yay, Peach Bellini Microfine Glitter. Such a fantastic technique used to create such a gorgeous card. This one is super cool. I know you guys are going to love it. So check that out. Folds away, really, really easy to ship. And then when they open it up, they've got this beautiful laid out card. I just love it. What a fantastic idea. So make sure you go to all of our designers blogs to check out to get further instructions for all of these. This is a really cool card. I love the use of the stencil and the glimmer paste on the top there. I wish you could see how really sparkly this is. We've got the amazing crystal drops and then stamping right here and some nice coloring done. Fantastic job. And of course you've got the background here using the awesome unicorn glitter, your, our brand new unicorn glitter. This is super purple utilizing that one stamp with the three birds, but then you can see how cool it is when you make little shadow boxes. You can just hone in on one design element of your stamp at a time. So really smart way to use like your older stamps too, to just take your little shadow boxes on your one stamp and then hone in on what you really want to feature. So really fun way to make that pop. I just love this card. And then you've got the amethyst embossing powder used in the background here. And then you've also got one of our fantastic glitters impulsive purple around all of those little shadow boxes. Our next one is a softer take on that using that same bird trio again and the wreath and one of the sings. So really fun incorporating all three together and it shows you a variety from the designers that are just using one at a time as well. Okay, brace yourself, it's pretty darn cute. How awesome is this? So this is one of the super cool tonic dye purses and this is the Chelsea shoulder bag. We did a video on this a little while ago and then she's also using the Nouveau Mica Mist to create that really cool throwback with that splatter paint background. I just love it. The So Grateful tag and the adorable little birdies. So remember once again, check out our blog so you can see all the detailed 
information that goes into creating all these fantastic paper crafts. I love this one here because you've got actual little feathers on the card. I love adding some of nature's elements into card making. It just really accentuates it, makes it pop. We've got our beautiful, the uh, I, I believe she used the quarter inch tape to make this cool glitter twine. Nice and chunky and fun. I love the color combination going on. And that is the Margarita. I'm gonna double check to make sure I'm correct for you guys. Boop -a -doo -doo. Come on, Donna, memorize all the cards. <sighs> and it is right, not on there. I can't see it. There it is. It says just pink fizz glitter. So I know this glitter is there too, but I bet you that is margarita. Okay, so last from this amazing stamp set, Feathered Friends. Here is a really colorful card. A lot of exciting things going on here. And this one is featuring the three birds as well. And then one of the stamp stains. You've got the glimmer paste through a stencil in the background. You've got your super thick embossing powder, your glitter on your, on your terrific tape and then your micro fine glitter here as a background really works together when you use the two glitters really works nicely together just fantastic i absolutely love that mixed media look so our next one is a digital only and here is just some of the fun things this is rainbow roses 3145 and it is a modern interpretation of rainbow roses really beautiful and i just have a few cards from some of our designers that went ahead and did the digi only and isn't this beautiful it is a beautiful little shaker card and just so cute and sweet and delicate i absolutely love it you've got the gold embossing powder in the background you've got a beautiful princess rose embossing powder she's using her terrific tape a lot of fun stuff going on in there and then the second one from that is the this one right here and it's a totally different spin very elegant she's using her cloud nine right here in the background and i just love it really cool finish and technique okay the next one there is a digital and a rubber stamp set and i mixed all my cards together so we're just going to go through them one at a time but first i wanted to show you the actual rubber stamp set it's this here just adorable I absolutely love it i know what card i want to make and i know exactly where it's going and here is the image nice big solid tractor it's great and then you've got some really great scenes leave a little dirt wherever you go tractor tough boys in their toys really cool and this is by fred she said and the digital Look at that. I'm going to show you really quick just some of the selections and then I'm going to tell you all the goodies. So this is the digital and this is the old tractor digital collection and you get four colors. So you see you've got the red, the orange, the green and the blue and it's really cool because you've got it with or without a sky, several black and white. You can build the scene options Four sentiments with various styles to make all sorts of different cards so it's really cool there is so much to do great 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 set so if you love it make sure you check out the digital and then we also have the 3144 this is digi only this is farm silhouettes and sayings there's a total of 18 sentiments including five innie and outies some verses are duplicates, but they're used in different fonts, so you can accommodate more of your scrapbooking and card making styles. So really cute, a different tractor, more of like a silhouette. So make sure you check those out. And to get started, I've got this very fun little ornament, and this has a little bit of the tractor on it using one of the love stamps some sparkle and sprinkle embossing powder and some crystal drops and one of our sames. We've also got Tractor Tough, 
Look at how cool that is. It actually looks like a framed photo. Really fantastic. I love it. You've got the embossing powder, and then just going in and highlighting some of the um, some of the little detail things with a nice silver. You see that on the tractor. This one's really cool. Got a lot of embossing powder going on. This is how I roll. So you can see the designers are using different digital digital things. So the this is how I roll is from the digital stamp set. And then the actual tractor itself is stamped. So make Ooh, check this one out. I just love it. I love the incorporation. All the different layers. It looks like a scrapbook page, just so cool. You've got the embossing powder here, leave a little dirt wherever you go, and that is Irish Spring embossing powder, so it's got a little bit of shimmer in it. And then you also have the fantastic Silver Dreams glitter to highlight that tractor, check that out. And your crystal drops to add just little bits of embellishment. Really love that. Now this one, check out the colors used here. So you have your specialty paper, your crystal drops, this embossing powder, this is all embossed with copper embossing powder. And then same with the saying, and then some antiquing over the edges. Really cool, totally different. This one is using the digital stamp set. Really, really fun, the solid silhouette. Farmers just don't work till sundown. And then you've got your crystal drops. So I love the simplicity of that one, yet it has a really nice, strong look. And then this one here is a cool mixed media. You've got the tractor, you've got the glitter twine, you've got the layering, really fun. And then the use of the glitter again to highlight your tractor. I mean, you know, who would have thought that you're gonna use your glitter to highlight your tractor? It clearly needs to be done by everybody and that is reflection. All right, our last but not least stamp set. And this one was the one used for the Video Kit Club by Sparkle and Sprinkle. And this is Sketched Pear Stamps by Beverly Cole. And here is the digital version. So you can see it's ex uh, Sketched Pear's exclusive artist, Beverly Cole, who is fantastic. Two bonus sentiments if you get the digi. And then the cool thing, like you guys know, you have the different coloring options, also black and white available. So a nice combo when you get your rubber stamp set is to pick up your digital stamp set. And we're gonna go right into it. Here is a very nice watercolor finish card with our clear embossing. And then we have another beautiful mixed media one here with the window frame opening onto the card and the pair really nicely hand painted. Just lovely. We've got this gorgeous one here and you can't forget the inside, all the different goodies. And this sits up quite nicely and you've got the beautiful glitters. I will read you, you've got pistachio, the beach, butterscotch, the embossing powder used here is glitzy gold and that's for the inside saying. So a really beautiful card, fantastic ideas. Make sure you check out the designer's blogs for more details. This one, I wish you guys could come and touch it. It is really, really cool. Check this out. I love the use of the same stamp, but totally different. So here it is stamped with white embossing powder on top of the darker cardstock. And then here it is stamped with black on top of the white cardstock and colored in really cool. You're gonna to wanna to make sure you go check out her blog to see all the details on how this was created. Here we have a totally different look. I love the richness and darkness of the coloring of the pears and the pearific saying going across of it. This is how you create things with Digi. Totally cool that she got the huge pearific over the stamp set. And then the use of the crystal drops in there looks really nice and fun. And then our Video Kit Club this month 
Make sure you check that out. We have these brand new butterflies exclusive at Sparkle and Sprinkle right now. And there is a second color coming very soon. So make sure you keep an eye out for that. And that is everything. Make sure you take advantage of this great sale for a limited time. And thank you so much for watching. And thanks again for all your hard work, designers. Thank you.